Hello everyone, Professor Piyush here. Welcome to the next part of free SketchUp tutorial series from beginner to advanced. If you want to start from the beginning, find the playlist link in the video description below. This is section E in the series which covers all important tools and essentials required to complete the process of 3D modeling in SketchUp. In the previous part, the arc tool and its various applications and methods of construction were covered. In this video, we will learn how to use freehand tool in SketchUp. So let's begin. With SketchUp's freehand tool, you can create hand-drawn lines such as planter decorations, vegetation and others. The freehand tool is handy when tracing imported drawings, creating a 2D sketch or decorating your model. You can activate the freehand tool from the following places in the Getting Started toolbar. If you don't see the freehand tool, click the drop down arrow next to the line tool, the drawing toolbar in Windows, the freehand icon in the large tool set, and under the draw menu, the lines submenu. The lines that you draw with the freehand tool become curve entities. A curve entity contains multiple line segments but can define and divide a face like a single line. Although you can select all the segments in a curve entity at once. The SketchUp inference engine displays point and edge inferences for each segment in the entity. You can draw freehand curves on existing face or separate from existing geometry. To draw a curve, follow these steps. Select the freehand tool. The cursor changes to a pencil with a curve. If you want to draw your curve on a specific axis plane, you can use View tool to select the drawing plane for your curve. For example, if you want to draw on the blue axis, use the front view to do that. You can also use the arrow keys, left arrow for green, up arrow for blue and right arrow for red. Click and hold to place the starting point of your curve. Drag the cursor to draw. As you draw, the color of your line corresponds to the axis perpendicular to your drawing plane. Release the mouse button to stop drawing. The line turns black. Or you can end your curve at the point where you started drawing to create a closed shape. Curves in SketchUp are actually made up of a series of line segments. The more segments, the smoother your curve. To edit a curve, follow these steps, explode the curve, select the move tool, hover the cursor over the curve to locate an endpoint from where you want your curve to be modified, click and drag the endpoint to adjust the curve and release the mouse when you are done. Or select few segments of the curve from where you want to modify your curve, click and drag for adjusting the curve and release the mouse when you are done. That was all about freehand tool. I hope the application of freehand tool was clear. Follow the video and keep practicing to explore more of this wonderful tool. The next part of this series has covered topics like dividing and welding lines, splitting and healing faces, and exploding any entity in SketchUp. So see you there. Thanks.